close your eyes and watch your breath, watch your mind. We watch the breath to give the mind an anchor in the present moment, and we watch the mind to see if it's doing what it's supposed to be doing. When the Buddha taught mindfulness, it wasn't just simply watching things coming and going. If something good was coming, he said to encourage it. You were mindful to encourage it. In other words, you kept that in mind. If something that wasn't so skillful in the mind was coming up, then you were mindful to try to get rid of it as quickly as, and as effectively as you can. And when good things are there, you want to make sure they stay there. You don't just watch them pass away and think that that's insight. An important part of the path is getting the mind to stay with skillful qualities and abandon unskillful ones. We do this for several reasons. One is because it gives us a better place to stay in the present moment. You can develop a sense of well-being, a sense of ease. And also it's good in the long run. Whatever areas your mind tends to wander, that tends to be its inclination. And if you let it wander at will, that'll be its inclination, just wandering all over the place. In the Buddhist terms, he says your mind gets bent, bent in a certain direction by the thoughts that you allow to wander around as well, as they will. So bend them toward the breath. Bend them away from any distractions. It's be for your long-term welfare and happiness. Our culture encourages people to act on impulse without really thinking about things. You spend time on the, online, it exacerbates that tendency. Whereas the Buddha is saying wisdom lies in thinking in terms in the long run. What when I do will lead to my long-term welfare and happiness. That's what's wise. So think about the long term, and then look at your mind. What habits are you developing for the long term? You can develop good, skillful habits, or you can just allow the mind to wander around as it likes. And that's a kind of training, too. We don't think of it as a training, but you're training it in being impulsive. Which way do you want to go? You have the choice, so make the most of it. <laughs>